This is Kristen Bell. And Adam Brody. And we're dating. In our new show, Nobody Wants This. Right, right. We're not really dating. No, in real life, we're married. Right, married to other people, not each other. Oh, this is complicated. Right, it's just like our love lives and Nobody Wants This, a show about what happens when a bold and sometimes provocative podcast host finds her unlikely match in a sweet traditional rabbi. You can watch every episode of Nobody Wants This now, only on Netflix. Curious about lip filler? Whether you want a subtle pout or bold plump, Juvederm Lip Fillers can give you a customized lip look. Juvederm Volbella XC and Juvederm Ultra XC can last up to a full year with optimal treatment, giving your lips added volume for smooth, natural-looking, and long-lasting results. Whether you're concerned about your thin lips or simply want fuller lips, ask about Juvederm Lip Fillers at your next appointment with your licensed specialist. And download the Alley app, that's A-L-L-E, the official loyalty program of Juvederm, to save on treatments. For important safety information and to find a licensed specialist, visit Juvederm.com. That's J-U-V-E-D-E-R-M.com. Not for people with severe allergic reactions, allergies to lidocaine, or the proteins used in Juvederm. Common side effects include injection site redness, swelling, pain, tenderness, firmness, lumps, bumps, bruising, discoloration, or itching. There's a risk of unintentional injection into a blood vessel, which can cause vision abnormalities, blindness, stroke, temporary scabs, or scarring. Talk to a licensed specialist to find out if it's right for you. Warrior! You landed on the Coach JV Podcast. This is a raw, authentic podcast, helping you understand the power you have inside of you to accomplish great things. I'm just going to warn you, if you're sensitive, this is not the podcast for you. But if you're ready to rise, let's go. Warriors, rise! Welcome to the Coach JV Podcast. Remember, what you believe in your heart, you think in your mind, will eventually become your words and become your reality. If you can see it in your mind, eventually you can hold it right here in your hands. What you repeatedly do gets ingrained in your subconscious mind. What gets ingrained in your subconscious mind becomes an unconscious activity. And today I want to talk about stay silent and take no thought. When you take silence and you take no thought, the truth always comes to light. That's in every situation. Take no thought and be silent. The key to all of this is as I study deeper into Stoicism, Marcus Aurelius, Miramatha Musashi, obviously Christ Jesus, Yeshua, who was the greatest, I believe, Stoic in the world, uh, who took the world, our own sins onto his own back. Talk about Stoicism, right? And being able to control your emotions and thoughts and being out there for 40 days and 40 nights and being tempted by the devil and being able to stay Stoic within that. But Jesus gave us the hint, Christ gave us a hint to take no thought, to stay silent. And by staying silent, taking no thought, not overthinking it because there's your side, their side, and there's some sort of quantum universal truth there, right? The universal truth is that each person is living their own paradigm and experience and their experience is just as important as yours because their experience that they're having is the one that they need to learn the lessons that they need to learn to go through the healing process for their soul within this current paradigm. And I ain't their God and you're not my God. And so for by me making you believe that my way is the only way and my way is the right way, when I have no idea what you're going through in your living experience. Now, do I believe in my paradigm that there's one truth, which is Christ Jesus, Yeshua? Yes, I do believe that. I do believe that the teachings of Jesus Christ, Yeshua, um, are the true teachings. I believe that it is the essence and the embodiment of what humanity is here to do. As Jesus came as a Gnostic redeemer to wake us up from the illusion, from this illusion, right, of who we truly are. And the reason why he says, take no thought, because when you're overthinking, you're in the left hemisphere of the brain, which sees separation. Facts, figures, numbers, logic, it separates everything. Now you need separation in order to have the experiences that you need to have here as a human being to reflect on the things that you need to fix within your soul. So let me break that down. So by staying silent, taking no thought, you'll be able to see where you fit within that field. But if you're not staying silent and you're taking a ton of thought and you're trying to logically figure it out and you're trying to control everything, you're going to see tons of separation. You're going to point your finger this way. And when you point your finger this way, you're going outside of yourself and you're not going to truly see the thing that you need to see that you need to learn to heal your soul. 
So there's this repetitive process and this cycle that happens over and over again in humanity. And I'm talking from living, breathing experience. But you see it within other people. You see it within businesses. You see it within relationships. People continue to repeat the same cycle. They look outside themselves. They point the finger. And then they think they have the answer because they're looking external. And then boom, they're right back in the same situation two, three, four years later. We are here to break those cycles and all things being presented to you are things that are for you to learn, to reflect, to digest, and to respond accordingly to get yourself to that next level. And the best way to do that is to stay silent, is to take no thought and let it all flow to you and let the lessons actually emerge. So if there's something happening within your life, step back from it. Take no thought. Breathe. (sighs) Let it all play out. And the truth will always, always come to light. Warriors, rise. Get your shit together. Let's go. Love you guys.